Okay, we are loaded up, Dad and Liv. We are ready for a day of fun. So I get this question non-stop. How do I get my husband on board? How do I get my boyfriend, my spouse, my brother, whoever, my dad? There seems to be a resistance to the plant-based diet with men. Look, you guys, I grew up in the southeast corner of Nebraska where the state slogan is actually the beef steak. I never wanted to eat this way. I made fun of the vegetarians I knew in college. Now I'm the crazy vegan guy. I've been on a plant-based diet for 10 years. I'll be 38 in a week and I feel better than I did at 28. I think I feel better than I did when I was 18. I'm stronger, healthier, my skin looks better. I'm happier, more successful. So many things are going right and it's because of the lifestyle I'm leading. I'm not protein deficient. I build muscle. I have plenty of testosterone. I'm living proof that the plant-based diet can be the best thing that'll ever happen to you. Green's made it. I don't need a million dollars. I just want a wife, some kids, and a few less problems. Get them all into college. Maybe we could travel the world to see stars and comets. Think I want to meet your mama. I don't have a nine to five, but I'm going to find some commas. I don't need a million dollars. I just want a wife, some kids, and a few less problems. I'm just trying to wake up for some peace in the morning. Drink a little coffee till the daylight pours in Kiss you on the forehead and I'm headed out the door Cause I just wanna give you the world I know it's everything you deserve and I swear Things would be the same if nobody knew my name They won't put me in the game I'm critically unacclaimed cause I don't need a million dollars I just wanna wipe some a few less Are we having a picnic? We're having a picnic. It is an early lunch picnic for Olivia and I today. We found one of our favorite parks. We've got the ocean behind us. We've got the bay in front of us. We've got the jungle gym. This is our spot. Max and mom are at homeschool group right now. Liv is with me on these school days and again we have fun last week we went to the bay and looked at all the pretty boats and yachts today we came out on one of the keys near the ocean and we're just hanging out and having fun but what are you having honey burrito a, first. a burrito first we're having burritos before fruit even today i actually did some refried black beans they're organic i smeared those on the tortilla with some hummus and a little nutritional yeast and wrapped them up, threw them on the griddle to brown them up a little bit and the kids love them and I love them too, to be honest. Aaron chopped a big bowl of fruit for each of us this morning. So Aaron and Max have burritos and fruit. We have burritos and fruit and then we're finishing our little breakfast or our brunch picnic with some of Aaron's famous muffins. I was talking to a friend yesterday who's actually a massage therapist. So she sees and talks to a ton of people you know, throughout the week. And she was talking about how sad it is when she sees how most kids eat. She asked if we ever get, you know, negative comments or hate, you know, for raising our kids on a plant-based diet. And I'm like, yeah, you know, unfortunately we do. She was like, that's so crazy because if most people could see what their kids are eating on a daily basis, we're talking chicken nuggets, french fries, cheeseburgers, happy meals. And honestly, I grew up that way. I grew up with, with pretty bad food. I remember if I was with dad, you know, we were we were definitely going through the drive-through. And so it's fun for us to get to prepare really amazing food for our little ones. You know, I didn't know what Indian food was until Aaron and I got together. I was almost 30 years old. And sushi and all of these epic foods from around the world, our kids now eat multiple times a week. Thank you, honey, thanks so much. So the question Aaron and I get the most is, how do you make it work? How do you make it stick? How do you make it work, especially if your kids aren't on board or your spouse isn't on board or your partner, etc. Aaron and I always say, you have to make epic food. This is the abundance 
diet. We make amazing food for the kids that tastes good. Like nobody can pass up fresh berries. So healthy, full of those healthy carbs. Glycogen for energy. If you Google search what's the body's preferred fuel source, you will find glycogen. If you Google search where does glycogen come from, you will find carbs. So the friend I was talking to yesterday is Italian. He spent the whole summer in Italy and we were talking about olive oil. One teaspoon, one tiny little teaspoon of olive oil is 100 calories. One banana, one apple, you know, a medium average size piece of fruit is also about 100 calories. Now think about the difference in volume. Think about your level of satiation and then also go back to the thing I mentioned about carbs, glycogen, and energy. Foods like green smoothies that are full of bananas and mangoes and pineapples and fruit. And yes, we throw a scoop of protein powder in there. We are thriving on the cleanest of fuel, feeling so good, and our kids are too. If you guys are interested in conversations like this, connecting with like-minded individuals, which is so crucial. If you are gonna make a lifestyle change, it is so crucial to have the mindset, positive reinforcement, visualization. It goes so far beyond the plate. And then it also comes down to accountability. Accountability is so huge, right? So Aaron and I realized this for ourselves. We sought out our own coaching. We joined our own groups. And this is how we have succeeded with our health, with our business. People that hold us accountable for showing up and ask us how we're doing. And they really do help us succeed. So if this is something that interests you guys, that you think would benefit you in regards to diet, lifestyle, all things eat, move, rest, highly, highly consider joining our membership. If you haven't already, it's dirt cheap, you guys. We want to help people we want to see people succeed and more than anything we want to all be connected all right you guys sitting down to put my shoes on and get ready to go to the gym my favorite time of the day my second tip for how to get your man on board or how to get yourself on board with a healthier lifestyle is to focus on mobility longevity staying active until late in life working out stretching has literally changed my life afternoon workouts are my favorite. We've got beautiful blue sunshiny skies. So I'm just gonna take my time and walk. It's a good warm up so I can lift when I get to the gym. Dude, how how did you transition to a vegan diet? I'm afraid I'm gonna like shrivel up and blow away. I know because I had all of these very same fears. It's crazy to me that I'll be 38 years old in five days and I feel better and look better than I ever have. You know, everybody always says, oh, I need to get back to when I'm 18 or I'm not 18 anymore. You know, all these things. Well, not me. I feel like I'm reverse aging. Coming home to my beautiful family. Look at mom. Look at that. Look at it. Almost 40 years old. We're getting up there, you guys. We're getting up there, but we're feeling better than ever. I had a great workout. I know these guys are having a great workout. We feel so good. This is about health, wellness. This is about abundance. This is about lowering inflammation, feeling better in your body. Oh man, I'm just so happy that we stumbled upon this lifestyle. I'm actually glad that I had some issues that I needed to sort out because otherwise I wouldn't have stumbled upon this way of eating, this way of living. It feels so good. This is truly an abundant life, you guys. Okay. Stepping back into the bathroom to get freshened up. Aaron and the kids are still outside running around, having a ball. My third and final tip for you guys, probably the most exciting for the guys, honestly, and the ladies too, is I'm gonna plug her ears. Sex, yes, better sex. More libido, you guys. When I said I feel like I'm 18 again, it's not just because I look better and I feel better, it's because my libido and my performance, all of these things are like off the charts. You don't end up with a litter of kids by not doing it. Aaron is gonna be so embarrassed about this video, about this part especially, but it's so true, you guys. I feel like a teenager and I am not ashamed of it. And I know you might be saying, oh, you're still in your 30s, you're young, that doesn't affect you. 
you might be surprised to find out. I've had multiple people, yes, friends, even ask me about things like ED. And you'll find if you do research that ED is the canary in the coal mine when it comes to heart disease. It's the one of the first symptoms that pops up as an early sign of heart disease. That being said, I also had a friend two winters ago at age 36 have a massive heart attack that has left him brain damaged. Ask any of the doctors, the older you get, the more important this gets. It's a very real thing. And instead of taking the little blue pill, we say clean up your diet, remove animal products, reduce your cholesterol, reduce heart disease, diabetes, all of these things with what you eat and you're gonna feel, perform so much better. You guys, this is such an exciting feeling. Sometimes I'm embarrassed about how much I feel like a kid. So something to think about. Definitely a good way to get your man on board with a healthier diet and lifestyle. All right, and bringing you guys back in to the kitchen to reiterate, remember you guys, there are two keys to a man's heart. I just mentioned one, the other one is food. So going back to my first point, if you want your man to transition to a plant-based diet, especially, this is the number one, easily the number one question we get on Facebook, on Instagram, on YouTube, in our membership, is how do I get my spouse on board? How do I get my family on board, my sons on board? Make epic food. I love to cook. Now I didn't always like to cook. I haven't always been a good cook, but now, Oh my gosh, make epic food. And the exciting thing is that we've got the tools to help you guys out. We actually are right now promoting the Thrive Bundle, which has so many plant-based eBooks, programs. You guys know these bundles only come around once, maybe twice a year. Aaron and I do a giveaway. You can find all the details there, link below. You guys, it's only around for a few more days, so definitely click that out. You'll have all the resources, all the recipes you need to make epic, epic, recipes and delicious food for your guys. Second thing you guys know that Aaron and I offer is our membership. Within our membership, you have a weekly live conversation with us and everyone else in the community. You have a private Facebook group. You have all of our eBooks that we've ever created. And probably best of all is our Eat, Move, Rest app. It's a recipe and meal planner that trumps all other apps because we have all of the best plant-based recipes in there. We've got links to workouts, all kinds of stuff. You guys can get this all linked below. And since I'm in the kitchen, I'm gonna address kind of a bonus question that I get a lot. What if I'm transitioning to a plant-based diet? What about supplementing? I know that you need to take B12 and D3 and Omega and all of these things if you're transitioning to a plant-based diet. It's true, but it's not just true for vegans. It's not just true for people on a plant-based diet. It's true for everyone, even meat eaters. So this is what Aaron and I turn to. This is the Complement Essential. This is actually an old bottle that I like to pour my refills into. You guys have been taking this for years and loving it. Instead of taking expensive supplements that pretty much just leave me with neon green pee, Aaron and I take Complement because it's just the essentials. It's only what you need and nothing more. Because we eat such a well-rounded, robust diet, we're sure that we're getting almost everything we need. We're literally just taking this as a safeguard. Again, B12, iodine, healthy omegas, EPA, and DHA. You guys, this is so crucial, not just for plant-based people, but for all of us, because our food, our soil, our water, aren't what they used to be. So I'm not just gonna recommend this for you guys. I'm gonna say go out and get compliment now there's a reason we talk about them like every single month on our channel because we love them and we're seriously passionate about getting people healthy and so is the team at compliment we know them all personally highly recommend this brand you guys definitely go check them out it's all linked below coolest part is that if you use our link our code you actually save money they give us an exclusive discount for our followers and if you join our membership you actually get even more of a discount so all of these things are linked below comment below. Let me know if you guys like this style of video. If there's anything else you would like to see from a guy's perspective, let me know. I'd be glad to shoot more of these videos. Much love you guys. Peace.